Hi, my name is Tabernell and welcome to my show. This is an episode where I'm going to show you how I installed this fuel tank. Look at it. Isn't that fantastic? Isn't that the most beautiful fuel tank you've seen on a Unimog? Look at it. It's amazing. And this episode, by the way, is sponsored. My first sponsored episode by Satasa Engineering. Um, I paid a little bit, but he gave me an amazing deal. So, this fuel tank sponsored by Satasa Engineering. This is Sherwin, the owner of Satasa Engineering, welding the bracket for the fuel tank together. Do you want me to weld the inside as well? Um, what do you think? I mean, I can if you want, but... It's it's, you the expert? It's in a hole. Okay. It's gonna hold when 200 k's on that and you hit it a hole this deep Definitely. at full speed. Definitely. <laughs> <laughs> Looks pretty good. Yeah, I mean, it's just squeeze it together and then I'll weld it. Yeah. Clap it and then weld it. Yeah. I think we might bring it down. I think that's a good idea. Okay, cool. So we'll make the hole a little bit lower just so it takes that, yeah. it takes that bend as well. Because we want more rod for tensioning. Okay. To make the bar too long. We don't want the bar to hit. Yeah, the back. The gusset. Oh, okay. So we want to stop the because your gusset's about there somewhere. Yeah. We want the plate to end about here. Oh yes, yeah, to have all of that to pull it in. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. You're right. Exactly like that. Yeah. On That's the, exactly on the bottom. Yeah. I'd not draw the holes big enough. <laughs> I mean, it's in there, but I think it's the exact same. It's exact same. Oh, I, that's what I do. I draw exactly yeah. the same sizes and then. Okay, that's problematic. Because how the hell are we going to get in there to draw? Uh, you should check my work before you do anything. <laughs> <laughs> Sherwin's fixing my bad drilling here. that we got already. Okay. You know the holes that we're gonna make in the channel? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Put the holes in the plate as well. Okay. And then we just slide it through. Oh, how are we gonna put the, the backing plate on? So look at that. See, that, because this, mm, see, that's, another, that's thing. another thing. See, these are the tricky bits that I leave for you. Because you're an expert. <laughs> Whereas I'm an amateur. I'm used to this as well. <laughs> the amount of cars I've worked on with my dad. Yeah. <laughs>
leave them loose for now when we place the tank in there, put the spacers in, then we can nick them up, get the tank level and just tighten up the bolts a little bit. Cool. So the first bracket's fitted. Um, she went busy doing the plates and the, you know, the stuff for the second bracket. And uh, then we'll fit that and see how it fits. So we've got to reroute some of the um, cables a little bit. But it's, uh, it's, it's going on very well. Check that out. Perfect. <laughs> Totally, totally over engineered. Yeah. <laughs> it's gonna work well. I mean, I, I would never have been able to do this shit on my own. <laughs> At all. Not yeah. even close. Not even close. So 20 mils become 10 mil now. <laughs> <laughs> you have to grind those little <laughs> spot wells off. <laughs> but in saying that, I've got 10 mil there and I'm touching your bracket. Okay. So if we go another 10 mil, you'll have 10 mil in between. Yeah. That and your tank. Okay. I think it might be a bit better. Yeah. Cool. We'll just cut 100 mil off these. Okay. Yeah, because when it's sitting in there, the strap is... The strap actually is supposed to come out here. It's kind of going to squash the cables if I put it down. But not really, there's not much tension. Um, you just see? Uh, go for it. Yeah. Just a bit of tension right on there. That should be fine. By putting rubber hose across those bolts, it created a perfect bracket for the cables. Thank you for watching. The details for Satas Engineering is in the description underneath. Please press the subscribe button and next to it there's a little bell that appears. Click that so you will know when next week's video shows up. Please give me a thumbs up if you want to contribute to the channel. In the description underneath there's a link to my Patreon account. Please go and visit that and uh, buy me a coffee. Thank you. Bye.